The Minnesota Fighting Vikings reportedly got the bad news on nose tackle Michael Pierce's injured elbow, and the juggernaut may be up on blocks for a little bit. Ben Gessling, Star Tribune, go. I'm hearing today Michael Pierce could be out a while with the elbow injury he sustained last week, so TJ Smith, who played for assistant D-line coach Marge Albury at Arkansas, could give the Vikings added depth. Dalvin Thompson could ship to nose tackle with Pierce out. And Pierce got an MRI on the elbow he injured in practice last week and then re-aggravated against the Browns after he left after only 21 snaps. I'm sure that the Vikings and Zimmer will address it today as they return to practice. Zimmer has a press conference and they have to pit out an injury report, but the advance word from Gessling is not good, and Pierce will probably end up on injured reserve short term, and the TJ Smith signing is significant since he's now the only defensive lineman on the practice squad, but this is on Diesel Dalvin Tomlinson. This is on Sheldon Richardson. That's why the Vikings brought you guys in for some big money with Dalvin and a second chance with Sheldon. We fans have touted them as a starting caliber defensive interior for any team in the league, so even though Pierce is probably out for a stretch, no excuses get it done make us believe play like your hair is on fire every single rep absorb two to three bodies keep Kendricks clean to allow him to do Eric Kendricks things and then on passing downs in winning time go and get it come on man also could mean a big opportunity for Armand for Watts as Andre Patterson loves subbing him in for Michael Pierce as well as jump and James Lynch who played a lot of pass rushing nose tackle in preseason and Patterson could also use edge rushers Everson Griffin and Steve Weatherly inside on passing downs like he's done in the past but Pierce is a major major loss man and the Vikings have already struggled against a run allowing 100 plus yards on the ground in each of the first four games including a buck 84 against the Browns I mean, it really opened up after Michael Pierce went out and now they've lost one of the best nose tackles in the game against the run for a while. So it's not good, but the cupboard is not bare. Next man up. No excuses. Get it done. Make us believe. Come on. Uh, but your thoughts and our thoughts, Michael Pierce could be out a while. Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support that work? Pull us something in Venmo. But until next time, Skull Production Value.